Hello and uh, welcome to this channel, uh, in uh, which we will make uh, Fibber Zero from this. Uh, this actually costs like uh, three to five dollars. It's a uh, microcontroller, obviously, and uh, if you visit some other site like uh, Reddit or something, and uh, somebody tells you that it's impossible to make a uh, flipper zero on the like uh, one thousand dollar. Maybe you should check uh, their position. And what is their po what is the position of these people in uh, flipper devices? They are from sales team. Would you trust me who is giving you flipper zero for like uh, twenty dollars complete? Or would you believe somebody from? sales team so uh, this in this in this episode we will show how to uh, flash a one-time program uh, so you will you will be able to just uh, connect this uh, uh, to web flipper and uh, it will just work and uh, we will flash it uh, with uh, uh, edit it uh, flipper zero firmware because uh, this mic controller uh, it's same, but uh, it has uh, like a different package, uh, so uh, you need uh, to make uh, some uh, adjusting, but uh, it's, it just work. So let's get into it. So how do you make it? Basically you need push this button which tells boot and connect it with USB, you know? Like this, and uh, it should be in uh, the FU mode. And uh, next step is uh, just open ST programmer, like a Q programmer. It's a really nice program, and uh, I will do like a zoom. Yes, it's a zoom, and. Uh, just a window a little bit and uh, here uh, you will choose USB it uh, and uh, try to connect as you see, as you can see it can connect and uh, how do you flash uh, your data uh, here? You, you can you can do, do the flash of uh, uh, basically anything and uh, you just need uh, to know the right address which is this and uh, how do you know the address maybe uh, you can uh, uh, look here uh, to Flipper zero firmware. As you can see, here is uh, your address. Wow, the address. And uh, you put uh, address here. And uh, you need uh, uh, some files uh, which uh, you can uh, you can find uh, in uh, in the description on the video of the video. I will just. Uh, And it's a, uh, as you can see, it's a uh, OTP second and first. And you need to uh, flash first on this address. And the second, you will you will just add ten to it. You know, like ten. It's it's nothing hard. And uh, and uh, you will press uh, start programming. And I, be I believe I already did this uh, on this particular board. I will see. Yes, and as you, as you can see, I have or I have this data. Now, this is and uh, what is important to know is that uh, this uh, part of memory, it's uh, it's uh, like fuses, and uh, you can burn the fuses, and uh, that's how uh, you make. Uh, but you know, but uh, you, you cannot uh, like uh, fix the fuse. 
Uh, so you can uh, do this uh, only once. Uh, so it's uh, better to don't mess up it. And uh, uh, obviously you can uh, you can uh, for first time you can flash it in like uh, these others. And after you will see yes, I flash it uh, properly. You can uh, you can uh, flash it to the right address. That's actually a pretty good idea. And uh, with uh, this flash it, you can. Uh, open a web flipper and uh, when you do it first you will see it's it's a uh, zero and stuff and uh, because uh, it's have like nothing and we need to uh, flash it uh, with uh, like a bootloaders and and and, and uh, uh, stuck for the radio and and and, and stuff uh, uh, for the first time it's uh, best to do to do repair so you just click repair and it will download download the down, download firmware and flash firmware. And after this uh, th this point, it will crash. I I, I telling you uh, right now it will crash and it is okay. You know it's it's no problem. It it, it will crash. Uh, so now I will just uh, turn it off and I will turn it on uh, when it will be done. Or maybe maybe I will not. Maybe it will be fast. Let's see. Yeah, it's, it's not that bad, so I think I can let it run in. And uh, this, will, this will basically flash it with the uh, stock firmware, which is uh, not working without uh, some modification, but uh, maybe, maybe you can tell already that uh, but I did this modifications for you and uh, in this video we will show basically a how to start it so it will not do much it will uh, it will be able to do like uh, connect with your phone and to do bad USB and stuff and you see it crashed but now you actually have uh, you actually have uh, flashed everything uh, you need and you don't need to care about it and now we will do install from file and install a uh, momentum firmware uh, which I did modify it so it is compatible with this uh, microcontroller and uh, you can uh, like, uh, like download it under the video you know classical and uh, we will flash it with uh, this modified version which is uh, basically basically uh, ready to run even without any anything anything uh, more here. Uh, so it's keep uh, it's keep any synchronization of things uh, you don't have and you will not have. Uh, I'm telling you right now you will not have like a, a charging chip and 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 RGB diode. Then who need an RGB diode? Then I, I I'm not. I I will not pay like. Five thousand thousand counts more for for RB, RGB diode, you know. Uh, so because uh, because it uh, doesn't have uh, much these these GPIOs, but uh, we can we can make uh, pretty much complete flipper with this. Trust me. And uh, so we will wait a moment because it's still flashing firmware, flashing firmware, flashing firmware. And after this flash, maybe it will crash, maybe it will not crash, I'm not uh, really sure. But it will boot the firmware and it will run the firmware. For now, without, uh, without SD card and uh, uh, without uh, pretty much anything functioning, you will be able to see like a menu and stuff. But uh, yeah, now, now it's like uh, trying to initialize like, in initialize uh, SD card and uh, as you can see it's not but watch it you know do you see it it's success and voila we have our flipper zero This is a real flip zero. It's not like uh, some some 
uh, some some rules and so some ESP or some sh something. It's a uh, zero <laughs> SD card needed. SD card is needed uh, pretty much for everything. Uh, but uh, you can you can see uh, if you do this that it's a uh, IST microelectronics with a com, com port. It's this is. I don't know. I don't have a flipper. I never had a flipper, so I suppose it's what it's look like. And uh, you can do this. And uh, you have like command command line of the flipper. And uh, that's. Uh, pretty much it for, for today's video and in next video we will show how to connect uh, SD card reader to it uh, so we will, it will start with actually doing something uh, and we will continue with stuff like LCD display, uh, sub gigahertz, um, NFC and uh, extend the header and uh, over, over this video series we will um, pretty much build our own Flipper Zero for around 20 max 30 bucks so like and subscribe you know the you know the drill just do like and subscribe